and just hoping to find the owner. I mean, we, we've done some really crazy rescues on the freeway, but um, yeah, this is a one to add to our list. And it happened. The owner found them. PJ, the lost parrot, is now back home with its owner after Pinkie Paw Search and Rescue says it caught the bird in someone's backyard. Uh, but that is not the catch of this story. Fox 26 News reporter Myra Franco tells us what is and the craziest part about this whole thing. I can't wait to hear. <laughs> we were originally airing the story to help find the owner of the parrot, but less than an hour after we got to Fowler, social media did its work and helped reunite the McCall with its owner. And we were there. But the crazy part is, hear this, the founder behind the nonprofit that saves and rescues countless pets just happened to be working across the street where that parrot was reported lost. We've done goats and hawks and possums and pigs and and now add to that a parrot. Pinky Paws search and rescue for the save reuniting PJ with its owner Monday afternoon. I am the designated trapper. <laughs> a neighbor posted on the Friends of Fowler Facebook page that the parrot was in their yard. That's where Alan Woodward came across the post, not knowing he would be the one to rescue All right, it. Let's go find your, uh, your home. <laughs> <laughs> you dancing? <laughs> okay. His wife, Crystal, the founder of the nonprofit, happened to work across the street where that neighbor who shared the post lived. A citizen came into City Hall where I work and was also mentioning that their friend had the parrot in their backyard. Alan says he had just got home from taking a dog to the vet. And then, ta-da! <laughs> His wife called him saying the parrot he had seen online needed a rescuing down the street and off he went. Oh, Good job, yeah. baby. Put on the internet. <laughs> <laughs> Is this okay. okay, thank you guys. Thank you. After the recovery, they then door knocked at an entire block looking for the owner, only to get a call that the owner was looking for them. They all met up at Fowler City Hall where the owner and parent were happily reunited, at least for now. She's an escape artist. So. But Pinkie Paw Search and Rescue says when she escapes again, they will be there 24 7 to make sure PJ and every other missing animal finds or has a home. It always seems to work that way for us. Uh, everything falls into place like these animals are meant for us to help save. Um, that's what we're here for. So cute. The owner tells me this is the third time the escape artist has left the house. He was very thankful to have found her this time again. Monty, look. <laughs> I don't even know what to say. At one point uh, in the video, though, a dog is seen near the parrots, and the parrot seems pretty calm about it, Myra. Yeah, so the owner actually told me PJ has furry siblings at home <laughs> and that she is used to being around them. What a story. I'm still amazed. Crystal says they've seen about 5,000 animals over a span of 18 years. All's well that ends well, right? Absolutely. And Crystal does some fantastic work. The nonprofit, it's all volunteer based. It's run by the husband and wife. Donations are what helps keep that mission running 24-7. We've done countless stories with them. Crystal Woodward does fantastic work there.